good afternoon this is rishali and in my last session we learn about some introduction and examples of machine learning hope you have watched those video now in this video we will learn about the concept of training versus testing data set so let's see now see here this is just diagrammatical representation of training and testing phase suppose this is your complete data set data set means collections of data for example student data set so which includes roll number name their uh, academic subjects percentage marks right so this is called as one data set so those data set can be divided into the two part one is training data set another is testing data set so training data set which used for training purpose and this thing is called as train model and testing data set can be used for testing purpose those thing is called as evaluate model so let's see uh, now see here the first phase is called as training phase uh, now see in this diagram in training data set we will provide the input to the particular machine okay so this input is in the format of image and the label okay in supervised learning algorithm we will use this concept right so what is meant by supervised unsupervised algorithm we will learn in our next session so in this video uh, we will learn about just the concept of training phase and testing phase okay so see here the first step is you need to train your machine okay so for training purpose we will use a particular attributes and their class labels this is the input okay so here attributes are images of apples and the label is apples so we will pass this input to the machine for uh, preparing a model for training purpose so machine can learn those images machine find out the relationship between each and every image machine learn the pattern of apple the features of apple okay then again some characteristics and specification regarding the apples so machine learn those images and their labels this is called as training phase okay and at the time of training suppose particular error is occur then uh, applying the particular model for the same data okay for which model is trained means here we will train the model regarding apple only not any other uh, fruits okay so this is called as training phase so what you should remember in training phase we will use supervised learning algorithm and for training phase we will pass the input is in the format of attributes and labels okay this is compulsory format labels is compulsory in supervised learning algorithm okay and machine learn from those data next now the next one is a testing phase so first step is you should train the machine okay machine train the particular uh, machine trained by using some particular images and their labels that is apple so machine knows this thing now in testing phase you should use remaining data set for testing purpose okay so suppose at that time you should pass the machine the images of apple then machine give you a proper result yeah this is a image of apple but suppose when you provide the image of orange or when you provide the image of mango to the machine so machine doesn't generate the result machine shows you that is not apples right because you train the machine only regarding the apple images not the other images right so this is called as testing phase you should test the machine that machine can be generate a proper result or not so uh, for testing data set the data set which class label is unknown okay here we provide in training data set label and the image but in testing phase you should provide only image okay so machine match those images with their training images and generate a particular result okay so the test data set is used for assessment purpose only and which measure the accuracy of your model or accuracy of your machine so training and testing data set is completely different testing error that can be occur when accessing the model by providing the unknown data to the model okay so here suppose you should provide the orange or any other suppose mango to the particular machine so at that time error will be occur right so this is called as testing error so in simple way the actual output of testing data is to the predicted output okay you know that when you pass the particular image of apple then machine generate the apple as a label right so this is called as predicted data and this is called as testing phase so what you will learn 
ट्रेनिंग फेज वी विल ट्रेन द मशीन रिगार्डिंग द पर्टिक्युलर इमेज एंड द लेबल एंड टेस्टिंग फेज वी विल टेस्ट द पर्टिक्युलर मशीन बाय यूजिंग सम इमेजेस ओके इफ द इमेज इज फॉर एप्पल इट गिवस य प्रॉपर रिजल्ट और इट प्रोवाइड्स द एक्यूरेसी ऑफ द पर्टिक्युलर मशीन क्लियर सो दिस इज अ कंसेप्ट ऑफ ट्रेनिंग एंड टेस्टिंग फेज now see here this is just conceptual view of training versus testing so this is suppose you are given data set okay there are some uh, circular images and plus images there are different images in this universal set so first step is training set okay you should train the machine regarding those images which images is for circle and which images is for plus so machine train those images and classify those images okay and for testing purpose you should use those image for testing purpose so when you uh, provide the particular circular and plus images so these images also will be classify as per their features okay but see in this diagram the some plus images it also move on the right side and there are also some circular images move on the left side of this classifier right so the accuracy of that particular machine is not a 100% okay so we can say that the particular model is 90% accurate which not generated the uh, particular result as compared to training set right so this is a concept of training versus testing so hope so you should understand this concept thank you keep practicing